This video is brought to you by Prompt Valley Air Conditioning and Heating. 775-727-7488. Since the beginning of this pandemic, 400,000 small businesses have closed. 400,000. And millions more are hanging by a thread. These small businesses, not the ones with 500 employees, but these small businesses that were the handful of folks they are 90% of the businesses in America. But when the Paycheck Protection Program was passed, a lot of these mom and pop businesses got muscled out of the way by bigger companies who jumped in front of the line. And I want to be clear, the Paycheck Protection Program is a bipartisan effort. Democrats and Republicans helped pass it. But Democrats and Republicans have also voiced concerns about improving it. With their input, that's what we're doing in our administration, improving it. On Wednesday, the Small Business Administration is going to establish a 14-day exclusive PPP loan application period for businesses and nonprofits with fewer than 20 employees. People can, can go out and find uh, how to get a hold of these, uh, these loans. People can find out more at the SBA.gov. Small Business Administration will also remove barriers that have stopped many businesses from being able to apply for these loans. These changes will bring much needed long overdue to help to small businesses who really need help staying open, maintaining jobs and making ends meet. And this is a starting point, not the ending point. Getting our economy back means bringing our small businesses back. And that's what we're going to do. That's what I'm doing today. We're going to focus. The program ends at the end of March, but for the next two weeks, the only folks who can apply for that PPP money are businesses with fewer than 20 employees. Thank you very much.